We're Stefano and Sasha, and we are currently renovating our new Lance truck camper. This is not our first renovation. We just spent three months building out our beautiful shuttle bus and living in it in Mexico, but we've decided that bus life is not for us. So we've sold the bus and we're on to a new chapter. In our previous videos, you've seen us paint the camper green and gold. And in today's video, we are doing the kitchen and dining room renovation. This is the before of the kitchen and dining room. And as you can see, it's all gray, monochrome, and it's pretty dark. Stay tuned until the end of the video to see the final result because we were honestly shocked at how good it looks. Good morning. Today is the last day of painting. Thank Finally. goodness. That's the longest job. Yes. Yeah, basically we paint everything. Everything that we could paint inside yeah. here, yeah. <laughs> and today we're gonna focus on the kitchen. Which is the last project mm -hmm. of the building. And so we're just gonna put like a tile. A waterproof vinyl. Well, sticker. Mm -hmm. And then we have this backsplash subway tile. Everyone uses these in their vans and campers. So yeah. we're joining the party. Peel and stick wall tiles for our backsplash. They're gonna go all over here. Mm -hmm. I think it's gonna look really good. Yeah, it's gonna look good. And finally, next week, we are leaving. We are going to Mexico. We're super excited. Love it. <laughs> How nice is our gold table leg? Someone is gonna install that. Is he happy? I'm happy. It looks good, hey? Yeah, it does. And Stefano is feeling better. Yeah. I'm First up, we removed all of the drawers and cabinet fronts. After cleaning them, we gave them two coats of this epic bright green color, and the color is called Sage Garden. Do you like it? Mm -hmm. I like it. It's like super bright. We got this deeper sink. It's so much bigger than the other one. The other one kind of came up to like here, so Stefano's going to plumb that. We lose some space down here, but it's okay because we have a nice sink. Looks good. A little spice rack. We're going to finish this today, right? We have to. So first up, our old faucet, there was two holes, um, one for hot and one for cold. So we have to cover this hole somehow. We are going to Gorilla Tape underneath it and then fill it with wood putty. We were going to... Um, screw some wood to the bottom, but we figured Gorilla Tape will be fine. Bit of wood putty, and then we can put the waterproof vinyl over it. And instead of putting the sink in the middle and making a new hull, we're just gonna upcycle this second hull for the sink and leave that there. So that's what we're gonna do first. What kind of cake are you making me? Strawberry cake. Mmm. What's this fancy tool you're using? Spacer. <laughs> A spacer we didn't need for putting the tie downs on the truck. Mm -hmm. I'm so proud of you for being good to the planet, baby. With the cycle. Mm -hmm. There you go. Good job. All right, we are renovating the kitchen. I've got my friend Luisa here. Hi. She's single. <laughs> Let's announce it to the world, just and in case. We're gonna put this stuff on, which she's done before, so I'm gonna follow her lead. What? <laughs> okay. Yeah. We have United Explorer. Please sponsor us. <laughs> please send us some please free send flights. Us some anywhere. Yes, please. <laughs> some carts with some goodies to stand on. <laughs> sink has been plumbed. That was so quick. I missed it. And now the best part of the kitchen. Right? You're right. Yes. We have 
had a slight problem <laughs> with the plumbing. When Stefano turned on the sink, it came out of these hoses by the black water tank and the gray water tank. So Stefano had to go check if they were full and um, the black water tank I'm pretty sure is full because um, the little test thing says it's full. So we have to go empty that, which should be fun. But we just had to close a valve in the bathroom and now water is not leaking. We have water out of our beautiful faucet. So crisis averted. Thank God. We don't need any more problems. Why do we have a curvy thing for the drain? For the drain? No, the curvy thing is like preventing smell, bad smell. Yeah, yeah, so the gray water tank doesn't smell. But we didn't know that, did we, before? No, I mean, the, in the sink, we, did we, the didn't put, we didn't put it in the shower. Mm. It looks good. All right, let's keep it going. Nice. So the water about is leaking. No, here, because here it's more less, but I think we should put silicone. Okay, plumbing crisis averted. Now we are just going to put the sink on. I'm the silicone girl. This is actually my favorite job of the whole build. I used to think that my favorite job would be painting, but after painting so much, I hate painting. But silicone is my favorite job. So we have a selection, clear white or something in Spanish that we got from Mexico. So we're going to silicon the sink and then we're gonna put the subway tiles on. And then I saw this hack on YouTube in the one YouTube video that I watched about siliconing the bottom of the subway tiles around the counter here to make the tiles look more real. Um, so we're gonna do that. <laughs> job ever no. I did not like that Stefano bailed on me that was too much for me. <laughs> it was not fun I would not do that again but let's see what it looks like you found a better paint the mm -hmm. other one that we used originally was like a like a flat, mat. mat yeah flat. No, flat. It was mm. also flat, I think. And it was like, uh, yeah, it looked like kind of like a barbecue outdoor. So this is, uh, what is this, sardine? Semi-gloss, semi -gloss, I think. Semi-gloss. Yeah. So it kind of like a look more real. More shiny. Uh, shiny, yeah. So we're going to spray paint this. And we already spray painted the cooktop white. So it looks nice and fresh. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to take them with us. So anytime Sasha doesn't want to clean the stove, she can just spray on top of it. <laughs> okay. Uh, what do you think? We're going to need more cans. Yeah, we're going to have like 12 cans. <laughs> Much nicer. That looks so fresh. It's glistening. Okay, this is our beautiful kitchen. Now that the kitchen is done, it's time to finish the dining area with a new table leg, a new tabletop, new curtains, new curtain rods, and new seat covers our gold curtain rods. This was all blinds before. These were blinds. And uh, I think the curtains are gonna lo look a lot nicer. We're gonna put the same curtains that we put in the bus with our leftover fabric from the bus. So that brings the total cost to zero dollars for curtains, um, which my mom's gonna sew. The dining area looks so much brighter and lighter with our new curtains. And we use the same peel and stick vinyl from the kitchen counter to the dining table. Good morning everyone. 
it's two days before we are leaving for Mexico and then driving south to Costa Rica. So we are just getting the last things done. We ordered these fishing covers uh, on Etsy and we washed them yesterday. So I'm just gonna put this on and I'm actually starting to move in. Sasha already moved in yesterday. So I'm just gonna move all my clothes in and I think we are done. I know we all love a little before and after video so here is our kitchen before pretty dreary and here is our beautiful kitchen after we are honestly obsessed we love it so much it turned out so well and here is our pretty drab pretty average dining area before and here's the after. It just feels so much more calm and serene. We're actually obsessed with this transformation. We have been carrying around these stickers for the last four months. We didn't put them in the bus. We didn't really have anywhere to put them. So we're making a sticker fridge. And hopefully gonna collect lots more stickers from our travels. And we both already love our new camper more than we loved our bus. It feels so much more homey, more us. We can go on better adventures. We can get more places. Cute! And we bought this one when we were building the bus. We bought it like in Maine and yeah. um, it's a truck camper. So it's perfect. Maybe we accidentally manifested our truck camper. What do you think, baby? Thank you for watching. Please give us a thumbs up if you like this video and subscribe to see more and to see our future travels. Let us know in the comments what you think of our renovation. We love to hear what you guys think as well.